good people. I, I, are you doing the um, postcard show too? Yeah, yeah, and, and you're in that too. I saw yeah. your stuff on Instagram. Awesome. Yeah, I've been getting weird with my shit. Well, I've been getting weird with my shit. <laughs> it feels like it's the right time to do that. Yeah, maybe it's that. Well, wait, you're not thirty any longer, I'm, right? You're saying you got into jujitsu when you were thirty. Yeah, it took. It's taken me three years to get weird. <laughs> nice. Well, <laughs> from that point, never too anyway. late to get. Well, there's this. There's. I work at Oakland Museum, um, and we have this reel of, of 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 artists just saying these little blurbs, and some of them are inspirational, and some of them are just purely like uh, informal. But one of them it was Paul Koss, and he was talking about how he's saying like since it's, I, I, I'm going to say it less eloquently than he does but um because i can't remember it entirely but it's something along the lines of where he's saying that since you're not going to make a living as an artist or at least it's very hard to you might as well do what you want like any demons anything you have anything you need to express anything you need to get out there it's like you might as well do it and then he said something you know tongue-in-cheek he said you know it's been terrible for my career but wonderful for my soul and then he laughs and the irony there is like you know he's showing in museums so he's doing just fine yeah and it's yeah, one of those it things where out. it's like it's a good thing that he was able to do whatever he felt like because it got him to where he is today